How's it going, guys? Dustin at Daily Grand Fantasy, and in today's video, we're going to be building out a positively correlated college football slip in the Kansas State-Oklahoma State game. Before we get into the video, though, if you guys are not subscribed to the channel already, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button while you're at it, because it really, really does help us out. We would appreciate it. And if you guys couldn't tell, my first play from the slip is going to be Will Howard over 274.5 pass plus rush yards. Now, let's get into building this slip. Right away, this is the Daily Grind Fantasy Correlation Tool. If you guys aren't familiar with it, get familiar with it because it's absolutely been crushing up 245.8 units uh, since 818. Now, we, we've been crushing both college football and NFL, hitting a little bit of soccer as well. So we have soccer, NFL, and, and college football recently added. As you can tell, we're doing a college football correlated slip today in this video. Last week, we hit multiple slips on Saturday. Multiple slips on Sunday for, for NFL. Saturday, obviously, college football. Uh, looking to do the same thing this weekend, obviously, tonight, Friday. Uh, we're hoping to hit one Friday. Go into the weekend soaring, right? little recap from Thursday Night Football. We were just shy on multiple correlated slips. We, we were 11 receiving yards from Terry McLaurin uh, from hitting 40x. So really, really close there on parlay play. Unfortunately, didn't happen. But we keep chugging along. It, it, we, we play volume with these slips, and you hit 140x, and you're good, right? Um, but yeah, it, the correlation tool has been absolutely crushing. Uh, so make sure you guys are, are getting involved, especially right now, leading into the weekend. You might want to get involved. I mean, there's 97 slips to play between college football, excuse me, college football and NFL, right? Get the correlation tool. Get these slips in. I'm telling you right now. Um, last but not least, linked in the description, you guys can go ahead and, and get access to that. And then, of course, we have our beloved fantasy bundle, which includes the optimizer and middling tool, which you can actually try for seven days free. Uh, linked in the description, where it gives you the best plus EV plays across prize picks, underdog, parlay play, all your favorite DFS apps. Uh, that's linked in the description as well. Both very much worth it. You don't get a, a seven day free trial with this one because it's all publicly tracked and. You guys can see right here, it works. $5 unit betters, even with the price of the subscription, are well up on the month. So just know that. Now, what I wanted to try and do in this video, we are going to build out our um, Kansas State, uh, Oklahoma State prize pick slip, right? But I wanted to go ahead and provide a little bit more value and use the fantasy bundle to our advantage while we have it here on the screen. I want to quickly build out a parlay play slip and talk about it. So we're going to do that. Taj Brooks is going to be our first play, and then we're going to get to the prize picks correlated slip for the the, the college football game tonight. Taj Brooks, Texas Tech, over 100.5 uh, rush yards, right? Look, you got sports books besides FanDuel. Every other sports book has this set to 109.5, so you're getting about nine yards um, discount here on uh, parlay play. So we're going to go ahead and take that nine yards discount and take Taj, Taj Brooks on the over of 100.5 uh, rush yards. Now, let's keep on going down the line. Patrick Mahomes under 4.5 rush attempts, 55.84% chance to hit. You see here, heavy juice, minus 145, minus 150, minus 154, minus 155 to go under 4.5 uh, rush attempts. So, ah, and it's been bumped. Oh, well, it hasn't been bumped because I was on the wrong app. But that just goes to show, guys. I'm, gl I'm glad that actually happened. Sometimes value on one app might not be there. If you see something get bumped, you refresh the optimizer, you see something there, and you go to get it in, oh, and it got bumped right away, go to Parlay Play. Parlay Play constantly has the best value and you can catch them lacking. If Pirates Picks has already had that bump down from four and a half, go check Parlay Play because they're oftentimes a little bit slower to go ahead and uh, bump these lines than, than some of these other apps. So if you guys don't have Parlay Play, use code DGF. You'll, you'll get 100% deposit match up to $100. But let's go ahead. Cortland Sutton under four receptions for the Denver Broncos. Under four receptions. Uh, against the New York Jets. It looks like, based on the sports books, he is set to 
uh, three and a half on all of these sports books. Some of them seem to be his even line. So getting this at four and, and five is the only way you're going to lose is a really, really good play um, at, at 55.48%. Remember, in, in a five pick insured slip on parlay play, you can come all the way down to 53.5, right? That's where, that's where your edge starts. You're getting this at 55%. Uh, that's insane. Xavier Howard, same situation here. Um, it looks like his line on sportsbooks set to three and a half. You get it at three. So obviously some push potential with these two props. Um, but yeah, you're getting the lower number here on parlay play. So you, you do want to take advantage of that and, and get it in here on parlay play. Next, Robert Woods. Sorry, actually, Will Howard over 24 and a half. We're already kind of playing that uh, on, on prize picks in a second. So I'm just going to go ahead and skip that. Uh, this Robert Woods looks really good. Uh, same exact scenario, 0.5 difference here on parlay play. You get the lower number of four, and let's take advantage of that. So that's going to be the slip here on parlay play. Taj Brooks, over 100.5 rushing yards. Patrick Mahomes, under four and a half rush attempts. Sutton, under four receptions. Xavier Howard, over three tackles plus assists. And Robert Woods, under four receptions. That rounds out the the prize or sorry the parlay play five pick flex we're going to go ahead and get into the correlation uh slip right now for prize picks in the oklahoma state kansas state game but i want to mention a five flex here on parlay play is way better of a payout than it is on prize picks get 12x for five of five and 2.5x for four of five for instance par, uh prize picks is 10x for five of five 2x so you get 0.5 more here and 2x more here uh you obviously get like 0.4 back if you go three of five doesn't move the needle as much as getting the extra 2x and the extra point uh 0.5x for those other two now let's go ahead and, and bring up the correlation slip let's look into this one a little bit kansas state oklahoma state here it is for today 7 30 p.m 96.22 uh profit margins uh percentage 86 or sorry yeah uh 90.76 correlation score so a really highly correlated slip right the highest you can have is 100 we get it at 90.76 as you can see these ones around it are less this is the highest correlated slip right now um on the screen so let's go ahead and reveal it like i mentioned we have uh will howard over 274 and a half uh pass plus rushing right if he's going to go over his pass yards, let's exclude his rushing at the moment, um, although it's included in this particular slip. But if he's going to go over his pass yards, it's likely that his receivers are going to go over either receptions or receiving yards uh, in order for him to go over that, right? It just, that's what correlation is, right? When when one outcome is expected to impact uh, these other outcomes in a positive uh, way, right? So that's what we're looking for. There's also negative correlation, right? You don't want to take, um, you don't want to take a QB's passing yards under and then his receivers overs, right? It just doesn't make sense. If he's gonna go over pass yards, it's likely the receivers are going over receiving yards, not likely that they're going under, or you know, vice versa, right? So Will Howard over two seventy four and a half. His receivers that we're gonna be taking, Jaden Jackson over thirty nine and a half receiving yards, and then Philip Brooks over five receptions. Let's come back here. We'll get Jackson in our slip. So his receiver over receiving yards, you know, positive correlation there. And then our other one was Philip Brooks. Brooks over five receptions, right? So that's our, our correlation on the Kansas State side of this game. Now taking this in the same game, now taking these other plays for Oklahoma State in the same game with this Kansas State game, is positively correlated, right? If it gets into a shootout, there's a lot of passing, etc. If one team gets up big by passing the ball, the other team is then, sorry, excuse me, is then expected to go ahead and throw the ball a lot to catch up. Uh, there's a couple different ways it can kind of work out for us. Um, but the one thing I do want to mention is getting this here on, on prize picks instead of playing it on the sports books or, or like FanDuel in a same game parlay is all the worth it. The, uh, like it's it's insane um the other day we had a slip that we entered in for the monday night football game all right the monday night football game we put it in on, on uh a same game parlay on fanduel 
and and then we put it in on prize picks. There was like a three hundred dollar difference in the payout, right? You get such a better bang for your buck playing this in a six flex six flex on prize picks. Which if I'll, I'll show you guys, uh, in a six flex on, on prize picks, you're getting this at minus one nineteen implied odds as opposed to the sports books. These plays can be juiced to like minus one eighty, minus one fifty, you know, whatever it might be. Um, getting it at minus one nineteen, you know, on on uh, prize picks is such a better bang for your buck. Like I said, like a three hundred dollar difference in payout if you were to play it on a same game parlay where you're getting dinged. You're getting dinged for positive correlation on the sports books. You don't get dinged here on on prize picks and these other uh, set payout platforms. So it's a big deal to play these over here and not on the sports books. And that's part of the edge, right? Getting that better payout um, and being able to positively correlate without getting dinged. Okay, now we have uh, Oklahoma State. We need Allen Bowman over pass yards. So the other QB on the other side, Allen Bowman over pass yards, 229 and a half. Positively correlated with what do you what do you say? His receivers. Dejon Stribling over 53 and a half receiving yards. And then we have Brennan Presley over three and a half receptions. Dejon Stribling over 53 and a half receiving yards. And then what was it? Press Brennan Brennan Presley over three and a half receptions. So if Alan Bowman's going over 229 and a half, it's likely Dazon Stribling is going over 53 and a half receiving yards, and Brendan Presley is catching three and a half receptions, thus resulting in receiving yards, thus helping the over for Alan Bowman in this game. Right? Obviously, this is looking for a a high scoring game script, maybe like a shootout type of game script. That's what we're rooting on here in this particular slip. We can see slips where it's going to be unders favorited, right? All of this takes into consideration uh, the, the props we have here available to us on prize fix, the juice on their overs and unders um, via the sports books. Basically, what, what we have here on the optimizer, right, takes that into consideration um, and, and many different things. The game script, the, the wide receiver ones, the wide, you know, a, a bunch of stuff is involved and done here on the back end for us to positively correlate these in the best way possible, giving you the best slips. Like I said, we give you full slips, guys. It's an insane tool, and it works clearly. It is up uh, 245.8 units. Uh, once again, get involved. Get get the correlation tool if you guys don't have it already. Get ready for Saturday and Sunday where you're going to be entering in all of these slips. Like I mentioned, we have 97 slips, was it, uh, available to enter right now. So make sure you guys are tuned in. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully, you learned something. Uh, if you're tailing, drop a like. If you did learn something, drop a like. Uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed, and we'll see you in the next one. Let's cash.